Hey, we're gonna make a butcher's apron. All right, guys, welcome back to Monster Misfits. Today, we're gonna make a butcher's apron. Now, you can buy these things fairly cheap. Finding a place that sells them is a little difficult sometimes, so we're just gonna, we're just gonna make one. Uh, I could make one of these at home on my sewing machine, but we're gonna do it this way. So what I've got guys is I went and got a uh, painter's drop cloth. Uh, I think I paid eight bucks for a four foot by 12 foot. And you can get several of these out of uh, one pattern. We're just gonna use this for a pattern. So. I'm just going to slide it up here like so. I really like using this canvas stuff to make things with. It is nice and heavy and durable. You can make all kinds of stuff with that, with that canvas. So what I'm going to do is just try to line one side up here. So all I'm doing is just lining this up and we're going to use this for our pattern. You don't have to be perfect on anything, uh, we're just making an apron. I'm going to use a sharpie to get our pattern out here. So there's sort of our pattern. Now you can use the red apron if you want to, but if you want to put blood or something on it, then I wouldn't suggest using the red apron. And just cut your pattern out. See how the rope goes off to the side? That's how we're going to put this rope on. Thing. So, all I'm going to do is kind of give me a measurement. It's half this half. Okay. Now, guys, keep in mind this rope part will irritate your neck, so just keep it in mind.
All right, guys, so what we did is we hung our apron up here, and now we got to just put some blood on it. You know we got to have our blood on it. So let's put that on there. There you go. There's your butcher's apron. Easy peasy.